This was the theater in Times Square that premiered one of the most controversial movies of American history. So the name of the movie was Birth of a Nation, and it premiered in 1915. Here at Liberty Theater in New York, it was so controversial because not only was it one of the longest, most expensive films of the time, but it also portrayed the KKK as heroes and free black people as villains. It was a movie about the South during the Civil War, and it was famous for its blackface, for its portrayal of stereotypes about black people like eating fried chicken. It's also famous for reigniting the KKK, which had existed between the 1870s and 1880s, Back when this movie was released, it actually reawakened a lot of white people's desires to join the KKK and led to a whole era of anti-black racism. So this was a major box office hit. Was there any pushback as well? Yeah, there was a lot of pushback, specifically from black Americans. Uh, the NAACP at the time was a new organization, but it led protests in Boston with leaders like Ida B. Wells and William Trotter and Booker T. Washington trying to get this movie centered because of the harm that it was causing to our community. Goes to show there's so much more history to find out here in Times Square. Stay curious, my friends.